Your eyewitness weather forecast. Good evening, meteorologist Sienna Masowski here with your check in on the weather. We're looking at a time lapse of downtown Utica throughout the day today. We started off pretty chilly below zero, though we did manage to get into the double digits by the afternoon hours with mainly clear skies throughout the day. Now, for current conditions, we're sitting at one degree below zero, and we have those winds out of the east at seven miles per hour, which is making that feels like temperature at 14 degrees below zero. For a low temperature tonight, across the board below zero, 23 below the in Old Forge, 10 below in Utica, and 11 below in Little Falls. Because of these cold temperatures, any slight winds can cause that wind chill to really drop. That's why we have a wind chill advisory in Oneida County as well as northern Herkimer County. Feels like temperatures could be between 10 to even 25 degrees below zero. This is going to extend throughout tonight until 10 a.m. tomorrow. So make sure you got all the layers on the hat, the glove, and the scarf. Now for our highs tomorrow, we're going to get a little bit warmer than we did today in the 20s. 20 there in Old Forge, 25 in Utica, 28 in Illion, 26 in Cooperstown, as well as Oneonta. And moving that future cast forward tonight, mainly clear conditions. We do have a couple of clouds developing tomorrow morning, though mix in of sun and clouds throughout the day there. And it isn't until Thursday evening that we start to see some snow showers moving into central New York. And this will continue throughout the night into early Friday morning. Could see a couple of flurries during your morning commute, though drier during the afternoon hours with some sunshine peeking through as well in the evening evening as well. Now you might have heard of a very strong system that's going to be moving up the eastern seaboard bringing a good amount of snowfall in New England. Though for here in central New York we're not really going to be seeing much. It looks like maybe a couple of areas south of the Mohawk Valley could see uh, a couple of flurries for the weekend though mainly dry for us here in central New York. Now to recap for tonight we'll have mainly clear skies, light winds out of the southeast and a low temperature of 10 degrees below zero and then for tomorrow we'll have those partly cloudy skies with a chance to see those flurries during the evening hours. Winds out of the south 5 to 15 miles per hour and a high temperature of 25 degrees. Now taking a look at the seven day forecast, like I said before, partly cloudy on Thursday. We do have a couple of light snow showers early Friday. Then for the weekend, it will be quite chilly. Highs only getting into the teens. But once we start off next week, we could see there on Monday a high of 29, then 38 as a high on Tuesday, and 44 on Wednesday. So comparing it to highs only in the teens for this weekend, it's going to be pretty warm as we head into the middle of next week. We have more eyewitness news coming up after the break.